what we have a ray of light from denser medium strike a rarer medium and the angle of reflection is r and the refraction is r dash and the reflected and refracted rays makes a 90 degree angle with each other so what should be the critical angle so the what concept we are going to use so that is the concept of critical angle critical angle and uh, refraction critical angle and refraction so this concept we are going to use and uh, let's understood so this is the our denser medium having the refractive index you can call it mu 1 and the rarer medium having the refractive index is called mu 2 now how the light strike so from denser medium you incident a ray of light so having the angle of incident is i and then it strikes from denser to rarer so we know that the light will go away from the normal so this is going to be our angle of refraction so that is r dash but we also know that light is not uh, reflecting or refracting 100 percent it's partial refraction as well as partial reflection so that reflection will be here this is r and this two rays are perpendicular to each other now here if i use the snail's law so we are going to use snail's law here so that is mu1 sin i equals to mu2 sin r dash and we need to find out a critical angle okay one more thing for critical angle for critical angle so that sin c that is mu rarer upon mu denser from this formula if i take mu2 by mu1 so sin c is equals to mu2 by mu1 so that will be sin i over sin r dash now if we use the little bit geometry so this is a semicircular type of angle which is 180 degree equals to r dash plus 90 plus r so this uh, r dash we can use 90 minus r so this sin c is equals to sin i over sin 90 minus r this r is equals to i because angle of incident and angle of reflection always same so 90 minus i so sin c is equals to sin i over cos i which is equals to 10 i so the c is equals to sine inverse of 10 i so this is the correct choice and uh, if we just match the options this will be and since we convert the answer into the form of i or else you can also write down that uh, sine inverse of 10 r because both are one and same angle so a is correct option a is correct option so hope you understand